lovely people big warm welcome back to my youtube channel how is everyone hope you're all doing really really well if you are new my name is ellie i'm a mum and also a person who's just obsessed with keeping their house clean and tidy basically <laughs> so if you like anything to do with parenting tidying housework chores cleaning click subscribe before you go but anyway welcome to my latest video to my latest motivation monday video every monday is motivation monday getting you motivated for the week and I'm really excited about this video this video is all about brand new cleaning hacks that I have seen recently so these are ones that have been viral on TikTok Instagram YouTube you've probably seen plenty of these flying around and I'm gonna give them a go I'm gonna give the viral cleaning hacks a try and see if they're actually any good or if they're just one of those viral videos that actually doesn't really work. So stick around with me and let's try some of these viral cleaning hacks. I'm gonna give them a go so you don't have to basically and I'll tell you if they really work. So get a cup of tea, sit down and enjoy. Okay, so the first one I was desperate to try was this sofa cleaning hack where you dissolve a dishwasher tablet into some hot water. So that's the first thing I'm gonna do is just pop a dishwasher tablet into this hot water, let it all dissolve, and then I'm gonna get a microfiber cloth like this one here and I'm gonna soak it in the solution and use a big cloth. I wish I'd used a bigger one and you'll see why in just a second, but I'm gonna lay out the cloth here and I'm gonna put a pan lid over the top and I'm gonna wrap up the pan lid in the cloth, hold it tightly on the handle and I'm gonna use this to wipe down and clean my sofa. As you can see, it did slip out of my hands a few times which is why I said to use the biggest cloth that you have. But actually, you know what? There was a really nice finish when I was done. The sofa looked really clean. It got some spots out and it smelt really, really good too. And you know what? It was really quick and really easy. So I am 100% gonna do this again. My next one is something I see everywhere, but I actually already do this, which is just damp dusting. So all I'm gonna use is water and this super absorbent sponge to do my dusting and that is it. Absolutely zero product and I swear to you, it works better than if you actually use product. So simply using this sponge and some water, I'm gonna wipe across my skirting boards here and I'm gonna show you how much of the dust it attracts. It's like a dust magnet and look at that. And I swear, if I was to use product and a cloth, it really wouldn't get up as much dust as if I'm just using the water and the damp sponge. So you've probably seen this everywhere damp dusting like I said I have done this one before but it is viral for a reason because it is so effective This next one again is tried and tested by me, which is stamping your toilet roll. I love to finish cleaning my bathroom by stamping the toilet roll. I used to do this when I was a chambermaid back when I was a teenager and I haven't stopped because I just love the way that it looks. It makes the bathroom look so clean and tidy. Just fold it into a triangle shape here and make sure your tap is wet and just stamp it on the end of your tap and it will look like this. It looks so smart, I love it. I was excited to try this one. Apparently, if you put some tin foil in the dishwasher with your silverware, your silverware, but cutlery, it will make it super shiny. So this knife was really dull and I popped it in the dishwasher with some screwed up tin foil and I just thought, let's wait and see if this viral hack actually works. But do you know what? It actually did. My knives were much shinier than normal. If you look at that shine, I was really impressed. I keep seeing this one everywhere, so I was excited to finally try this. So next time you enter your bin, put in the new bin liner and get yourself a couple of cotton wool balls, which I'm gonna show you in just a sec, and then get yourself some concentrated disinfectant, some Zaflora, some Fabulosa. I've got some Zaflora here, and I'm gonna soak this cotton ball in the Zaflora so it smells really, really great. And I'm gonna drop a couple of these cotton balls in the bottom of the bin 
and the idea is is that it keeps your bin smelling really really fresh and actually I did this a couple of days ago and I can confirm that the bin is smelling really fresh and great. Okay, this one was new to me. I was excited to try this out. It is when you get yourself a toilet roll tube and you scrunch it up and pop it inside of your vacuum cleaner so that you can get into those really, really tiny crevices like behind the fridge or in between your sliding doors or in your window frames. And you know what? It really did work a treat. I'm definitely gonna do this again. Okay, this one is a bit more premium because the product costs about 50 pounds. I will link it in my description box below, but it is to clean your glass and mirrors with a window vac. Honestly, it will change your life. Clint got me this for Christmas and it is by far the best cleaning gadget I have ever used. I'm obsessed with it. So I'm just going over this window here with some soapy solution. And as you can see, you pull your window back down over the window. It is so easy. And I swear to you, it never ever leaves a streak. No more buffing with cloths, no more spraying and buffing and desperately trying to get away streaks. You will never see a streak again if you use this, I promise. It is incredible. But that was my last one, guys. So thank you so much for watching my latest video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe before you go and I will see you in my next video.